Tappy activated. In this video, we'll use our connection to exchange information about the main types of DEXs. The first kind is automated market makers, aka AMMs. They solved a big problem for DEXs, liquidity. Instead of relying on buyers and sellers to match up, AMMs use liquidity pools, pools of tokens funded by users. Traders swap tokens from these pools, while liquidity providers, the people who fund the pools, earn a cut of the trading fees. A very smart robot must have invented this algorithm. Charging ahead in the world of crypto mysteries, the next type of DEXs is order book DEXs. Similar to traditional exchanges, these DEXs use order books to track, buy, and sell orders. They can be on-chain, then everything happens on the blockchain, or off-chain. In this case, orders are tracked elsewhere, but transactions still settle on-chain. Delivering the next data bundle. There are also DEX aggregators. These platforms search multiple DEXs to find the best prices and minimize slippage, which is price changes during trades. Breaking it down into bits and bytes, DEX aggregators compare liquidity from different sources to offer the best deals for users. I feel the next reboot is needed. We'll find out all about the pros and cons of using DEXs in the next video. Tappy deactivated.